Hi Libra, it's L here to do your mid-March general reading. It's a general reading, so it will not resonate with each and every Libra who views the video, but if it does resonate with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It's much appreciated. Thank you to those who've already done so. Let's jump right into it. So, we have um, how Libra feels, some of the cards flipped over, um, and then how your partner feels. Um, Libra's money, how, you know, where Libra is uh, monetarily, um, and then Libra's health, okay? So, Libra, wow, you, you're sitting very victoriously, wow. So Libra, you if you got the Emperor and the Empress and the King of Pentacles, you may feel like you're in the perfect relationship, the, the perfect dynamic. There might be an outer appearance of a particular relationship that um, where where it looks like from the outside looking in, people look at you and your partner and say wow you guys are like a perfect match or you both of you are very attractive or you attract a lot of people there's also a lot of solid energy you could be dealing with the capricorn capricorn is standing out to me taurus it could be anyone um virgo um aries of course but whomever it is it's I'm just hearing like solid as a rock. Whatever this is, is solid. You may also be a business owner or you may have your own business. Maybe you, you do business with your partner. Um, there's You feel very, very confident um, in whatever you're doing. If, if, if this is a relationship, so you, you feel very stable uh, and confident. You feel like this is a mutually beneficial relationship um, from every facet from every aspect from the look of it from the feel from the intellect from the the long-term goals you guys want the same thing um, this is very good this is how you feel Libra your partner feels like the ten of swords in reverse the strength card in reverse wow and a seven of wands upright so you could be dealing with a Leo, another air sign like yourself, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. It could be anyone. Don't get too caught up in the signs. But this is a person who I'm hearing they don't want this to be over. They want to come out of the betrayal. They want to fix things. They want to make something right the ego has subsided a bit in regards to the the connection the relationship they're willing to fight for this they're willing to do battle for this um, they want to grow this they feel like they have to fight for it um, prove something they may be warding people away from you also um, something happened here within this dynamic this relationship to now where I think one aspect of the relationship one dynamic is being stronger than the other there may have been illness there may have been death here somebody's being strong and the other person is um, resting you know or allowing the other the counterpart to kind of take on the day-to-day -day, the dealings you know day-to-day -day dealings and other people coming you know at them or even if they have good intentions somebody is protecting you Libra um, somebody wants this relationship to they don't want it to be up. Your partner feels like this is um, something happened here, but we're going to get through this. Okay. Uh, Libra's money. How 
Oracle. What is going on? You could be the overall energy for the love is the King of Cups. So there is much love here. It could be dealing with the Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Um, someone who's solid in, in their emotions and in, in the showing of emotion. Someone who has a deep inner knowing and a feel of um, of love toward another. This is loyalty. This is um, yeah. This is this is a very loyal person. This person is really trying to do something for the unit, for the family unit. Standing up and, and making a difference. This could be the husband, Libra, woman, um, you know. For money, the world before a pentacle is great. So this says that um, you've gone as far as you can go in something. Maybe you've been holding on too tightly in regards to it, whatever it may be. It may be. Um, something to do with maybe a fixed sign Leo uh, Scorpio Taurus Aquarius there may be a large sum of money that comes in also that allows you to take take the next step uh, the next step up in status uh, so that you can start to you know continue to build you may have been saving or you are saving Something ends in regards to maybe the status quo that you had here. Something ends. Um, you you understand you've gone as far as you can go with it. Um, it's almost like I'm here and take the money and run. I don't know what that is. Um, whatever it is, it looks good. You may be holding your cards to your chest too, not letting in or out what your future plans are to grow the Four of Pentacles. You've gotten to a level of stability and now you're looking to grow it e even further. Maybe in a new direction, new job, new home, uh, selling a business, buying a business, taking money, putting it somewhere else. I don't know. Uh, health and well-being eight of pentacles queen of swords or so you need to work on this you need to get very stern and truthful about your health and well-being um, some of you are doing a lot focusing on a lot maybe work in school children home um, you need to do work on your health my Libra women you need to get very truthful and clear about any plans that you or, or goals that you set for your health. Um, yeah, see, the Seven of Swords governs these two, the, the health and well-being and the money. You may be holding on to plans about money, about what you're going to do with money. Um, and then you also need to make a plan of action in regards to your health and well-being. Uh, it looks like it's it's all on you in regards to health and well-being. Make a plan, stick to it, move forward. Uh, Libra, let's close out with some Angel Answers cards. It looks really good in regards to relationship and money. Um, some of you can try to revamp a business, business idea, business structure. You've gone as far as you can go in regards to if you believe. Okay. Abundance. Nice. We do see that here. So if you believe, maybe you can have abundance. So it's and abundance is health, wealth, um, happiness. It's, it's everything that you can, you know, think of. Um, so if you believe 
abundance okay um no extended readings but do keep in mind that we have the five dollar yes or no answer uh, reading and that's sent to you via email um, go ahead and take advantage of that if you have a burning question I need to know if I should sell the business or what I should do with my money that I'm going to receive or should I keep holding on to a situation that I feel is um, over or what should I do um, just anything, anything you can think of, yes or no, reading, uh, quick answer to your question. Libra, thank you for watching. I uh, know that I'm praying for you, pray for me as well. All of my information is below. Also, the link to book the yes or no reading is below. You will be asked to, you know, book it and put in a, a date and a time, but it, it, I can't get around that calendar. It's not necessarily... Um, that the reading will come on that date. So anyhow, um, moving forward, uh, it looks good. Be strong. Maintain your strength. Do what you need to do in regards to your health and well-being. You, you know that you need to work on it. Uh, work out. You need to get truthful about yourself and, and what you want, your long-term goals there. Okay, thank you, Libra. Take care.